There is no alternative. Let me do this, sir. There's no other way. But he's my nemesis. He's absolutely mental. All you want to do is make toast. And if you don't want any, the little bleeder never stops asking. We have to turn him on and win his vote. If it's any consolation, sir, he's been down here in the garbage hole for nearly two decades. I very much doubt he'll be the same annoying... Howdy doodly do. How's it going? I'm Tucky. Tucky Toaster, your chirpy breakfast companion. Tucky's the name, toasting's the game. Yeah, the machine's having an election. Without your vote, rumor might get swept to power. The whole place will turn to hell. We want you to vote for me. I'm more than happy to outline my policies. Before you do, I just have one question. Don't even go there. I know the question. He knows the question. You know the question. We all know the question. Very well. What is it? Would you like some toast? No, I'm fine, thank you. Why, would you like some toast? You've started them off now, sir. Look, no toast. How about some brioche? No brioche, no cornbread, no yeast bread, no flatbread, no sweet bread, no fruit bread, no rye, no soda, no breadsticks, no burger buns, babs, baguettes or bagels, no chapati, ciabatta, cracker, crepe or crumpet, and definitely no smegging donuts. Muffins it is, coming right up. Sir, we have no choice. If we're going to win this election, we're going to have to do a deal with talking. Okay. What do you want? Well, I want out of the garbage hole. Fine. I want to be placed in the sleeping quarters. No way. Sir. Fine. Plugged in. No. Fine. You eat 11 pieces of toast each morning. Three. Nine. Four. Seven and one croissant. Four and a pan of chocolate. Six. A bagel and a toasted tea cake. Fine. <laughs> you have my vote.